Welcome to another edition of App of the Week. Today I want to show you a Google add-on inside of Google Slides called Pear Deck. This is a tool that will allow you to create more interactive presentations so now your students can be more involved in participating in your presentation as opposed to just sitting and getting. So what you can do is open up a Google Slide and when you see add-ons on Google Slides, um, you can go to get add-ons and you'll see a few different add-ons that are available in there. It's a growing list um, and one of the options inside of there is Pear Deck. So I have already installed it. Um, so I can go and select inside of here and use Pear Deck and, and choose any one of these op options up here. So what you want to do is you want to make sure you, uh, you want to select where you want your new slide to occur. Where, where do you want, it to, want this to show? Um, and so I'm going to click on this slide number two so that it so that the, the interactive slide that I want to include in here will come after this one. Uh, so when I click on add ons and go to Pear Deck, I see I have several different options for um, the type of interactive slides that I want to include. Um, so I have these few up here at the top. Um, when you click on one of them, I'm going to click on the add warm up slide. Is going to give you this preview, kind of give you an idea of what this particular slide is designed to do and what the students will be able to do and what you will be able to see. Um, so it's a nice little option here for you to be able to look at. Um, you'll see that for each one of the uh, op tools or each one of the slide options you select. So once, let's say you want to keep this warm, warm up slide option. So now I'm going to go down here at the bottom and hit this blue button that says add slide. And then it's going to insert a brand new slide and then it's going to have the question to appear up at the top. Um, so you can go up here, you can change this question um, to be whatever you want this to be. OK, so now I have a question up here um, that now my students can respond to. I can go down to a different part of my presentation and add a different one. Um, when I go, I, I simply again just go to add ons and Pear Deck and I can add one of these four main options up here. They also have this advanced options. You see, they have some premium version things, so you, those are the ones you have to pay for, but they do have some other options in here where if you wanted to include a multiple choice question they have to respond to, they, you could do that. Um, they even have an option where you can include a web slide. So, once you have all of your slides together you have all the interactive slides that you need the next thing to do is present this in google slides with pear deck so that the students can see on their screen what you have projected so in order to do that what we need to do is in our google slides go back up to add-ons and select pear deck and this time we're going to choose present with pear deck it's going to give you some information uh, on presenting with Pear Deck, I um, encourage you to read that, but once you've done that, you're going to click the blue button at the bottom that says present. It's going to go through a process of downloading and converting. Okay, once it's done, it's going to tell you it's ready to go. And you want to click that blue button that says, okay, I see. I can see from my projector. And then it's going to give you a URL to give to your students as well as a code that they need to enter. So I'm going to show a student device. Now this works on any device, mobile device, Chromebook, doesn't matter. Um, and they're going to go into that particular site. They're going to have to sign in with their Google account. So it's going to ask them to authenticate. And then they simply enter the code. And then once it loads up for the students, they'll tell them, just tell the student they're in. On the teacher side, you'll be able to see at the bottom, it says one student has joined. So if you, if you have a class, you'll see two students, three students, you'll see your entire class has joined at the bottom there. And then now, once the teacher is ready to go, then hit the bottom, you can hit this little arrow, and now your presentation can begin. And now, as a teacher, you can kind of control the presentation. The students can see in their screen what you have projected. 
um, I can click on this and as, and as I go on my presentation slide so as it go on the student screen as well you see here I have my interactive slide where my students can enter information um, it does give them the ability to draw if they want to it can make uh, drawings that they just need to use their mouse pad to be able to do so so it does give them the option to um, illustrate if that's what you uh, would like for them to do students can also enter text you see down here at the bottom they click that A so if the students wants to type something they could you see as I type it, it just when I clicked on the, on the side it, it showed it showed there um, and then from the teacher perspective if I wanted to I could display what my students are doing and there's the students work so I'd be able to uh, view that and go over some of their submissions and some of their thoughts and <clears throat> and we'd be able to go on from there and as I move to the next slide we can continue to proceed um, so that is an example of Pear Deck. This is a Google Slides add-on that is a helpful tool to make, you, make your slideshow presentations more interactive.